inches and fuck it up. Boot it, boot it up, boot it up, boot it up. Boot it. Come to the party just to shoot it up. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel. I'm back at it again with a brand new video. The back to school videos are finally gonna start. And one thing about me is I do not like going to school, but I do like buying school supplies and all of that. I love watching back to school videos. I find it so interesting. Anyways, for today's video is a back to school clothing haul. I went to the mall the other day and I got some clothes for back to school. And before this video starts, I just want to say that I'm not trying to brag or anything. So before anybody comes at me like, what the fuck, like you're trying to... And I didn't get a lot of clothes because if you know me, you know that I have a shitload of clothes and I don't even wear it. So for that matter of fact, I didn't buy that much clothes. And this is just like the first part of the clothing because this is what I got from my mom's side. Obviously gonna get different stuff from my dad. So yeah. And I didn't get any shoes because I'm gonna get those like days before I start school. Because then I'm gonna be tempted to wear them so I'd rather wait than to get them right now. Anyways, enough talking and let's get right into the video. So the first store that I went to was Pink, you already know. I remember when I was a little sixth grader, my favorite store was Pink and I have like 20 sweaters from there and I don't even wear them cause they're all like ugly. They're all like pink, purple, and I don't wear colors like that. Anyways, this is the first sweater that I got it's just a sudadera or whatever and it's like not all the way zipped down it's just like from right here it's size extra small it was 55 dollars and 95 cents so yeah i thought it was cute if you know me you know i'm always wearing black sweaters and i was like you know what i'm gonna add it to my collection so that's the first thing that i got there and this is not really like back to school related because i'm not gonna wear this to school but i did buy this yesterday so I got black biker shorts, you already know, basic bitch, 831. I go to the gym and I wanted some new ones because I already have gray ones, but they fit me kind of big since I do have skinnier legs now. And guys, quick story, I got these, right? And when we were going to pay, I got them in a size extra small because the ones that I have in gray fit me kind of big and they're small. So I was like, you know what, I'm going to get an extra small. So we're paying already and then the lady was like, can you please go get another pair like that has a tag because this one doesn't have a tag. And I was like, oh yeah, sure. So I just ran to go get a random pair and I got a size small, but I didn't even check. And I just thought she was going to like scan it, you know, for the price. But turns out this fucking lady put it in the bag. So I got a size small and I took out the tags and everything. So when I put them on, I was like, wait, these don't fit like extra small. So then I checked. And it was a small. And I'm not going to tell my mom or anything because she's going to get mad at me. Like, why do you take off the tag if you know that this is and that? So I'm just going to deal with it and wear them. They don't fit me that big, but I did want an extra small so they could, like, adjust my body right. Because these just, like, look like there. I put them on and that's it. And the extra small did fit me, like, perfect. So, yeah, that's the tea on that. And I got underwear, but obviously I'm not going to show you guys my calzones or anything because that's private information. Next store that I went to was Hollister. And I just got this like plain black shirt. You know me. It's a bodysuit basically, but it's just like black. And it's cute. So yeah, it's just like this. And tiene like the thing para que te amarres from atrás. And it's like a thong thing, so... It's like better because you're not going to see like the line from the jeans or anything. So that's the thing about this. And I got this in a size small. Next thing I got were these jeans. And guys, guess what? So a couple months back, I was gaining a lot of weight. And I went from a size 3 to a size 5. And my thighs got bigger. My culo got bigger. My stomach got bigger. But then I stopped being a fat ass bitch. And I lost weight or whatever. So I'm back to being a size 3. So I got jeans. These are the first pair of jeans that I got. They're just, these are a size 3S mid-rise, super skinny. They're just like this, they're mid-rise, you know, nothing major. The second pair of jeans I've been wanting, but I could never find anywhere. And when I went on Laura's Boutique, I couldn't find my size. Like, I guess they ran out or some shit like that. So, I just got regular black ripped jeans. 
I have like three pair of black jeans, but they don't have holes in it. And I try to cut my own like holes in the jeans and they look disgusting. So I got these in a size 3S. They're high rise, super skinny. So yeah, they fit me pretty good. They fit me kind of big from the waist, but from the legs and everything, they fit me perfect. So the last pair of jeans are these light washed, I guess, kind of jeans. They're not like light washed, but they're like, I don't know how to explain them. But they're just high rise, super skinny, once again, pa cubrir la lonja because we don't want to be looking fat. So that is it on what I got at Hollister and the next store is Como Dice Louis Para Siempre 21. I got this shirt. I know you guys are going to be like, what the fuck is that? That looks hella ugly. I honestly don't even like it that much. My mom just told me to try it on and she said it was cute and I didn't want to be rude. So I tried it on and I did kind of like it. But then when I came back home and tried it on, I was like, I don't really like it. It's like too cropped. And I don't wear like cropped shirts. Then I got this black shirt. It's kind of like off the shoulder. It's like long sleeve or whatever. And then it has like this little thing in the middle of your tetitas or something. So it could like Inches. add the tie or whatever. And the last thing that I got there was this yellow shirt. I know you guys are going to be like, what the fuck? Yellow? Yes, yellow. But I didn't buy this for school. I'm going to go to LA on the beginning of August. And we're gonna go to this one thing, so I wanted to wear this with my jeans and my boots, you know. You already know how extra I am, I have to get a new outfit for every time that I go out. But that is all that I got at Forever 21. Now moving on to H&M. So at H&M, I got this white shirt. It's really basic, but it goes like with any type of jeans and any type of shoes, so that's why I got it. And this shirt was $9.99, you already know, balling on a budget. I just thought it was very cute and simple, you know, pa que me ponga todos los días. The next shirt that I got is the same as the one that I showed you guys right now. It's in black, because, you know, I'm always wearing black colored shirts. And they're not really, like, cropped, but they're not, like, hasta abajo, donde te ves, like, una hermana. So, this is cute. And, like I said, it matches with everything, so I got it. And next, I got this other striped shirt. It has red, white, and blue stripes. You know, 4th of July vibes, even though that shit was, like, two weeks ago, I think. Inches, eh, fuck it up, you already know. And I just thought it was cute and basic, you know, pa ponerme cuando se me dé la gana. And the last thing that I got is this gray shirt. It's like the other ones, but instead this one is like like this. I was going to get another one like that in gray, but I was like, you know what? Like I'm going to get something different. This shows a little piel. I'm never like wearing shirts that like are all the way down here because I don't know. I just never really buy shirts like that. So that's a change in my wardrobe. And the last place that I went was Sephora. I actually haven't taken out the shit that I bought. So I'm going to show you guys. I just got two little things since I had a gift card. I finally got a new pomade. And if you guys are wondering what I fill in my eyebrows with, I used the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade in the color Dark Brown. So go cop that. And then I've been needing new lip gloss. So I was like, you know what? I'm just by the Fenty one. I got the Fenty Fussy lipstick. Lip gloss, I mean. And yeah, it's just like a cute lip gloss. So that's all I got at Sephora. Anyways, that is all that I got today. I really hope you enjoyed today's video. Like I said, I'm not trying to brag in any way, shape, or form. So don't be coming at me. And I will be doing more back to school related videos because I'm going to be buying my backpack. And you know all the materials and shit so i will be showing you guys that anyways i really hope you guys enjoyed today's video remember to like comment and subscribe turn on your post notifications so you can get notified every time i post a brand new video and remember to always stay positive because we don't need no negativity up in this mm.